In this video, I'm going to document a bug in Illustrator when it comes to exporting artboards at very specific sizes. Before we begin, allow me to demonstrate why this is important. Various places around the internet have strict requirements for uploading. Here I am in Google Merchant Center trying to upload a square logo, which needs to be a one by one ratio. But the logo that I just created in Illustrator is coming out at 1000 by 1001 pixels, and that doesn't meet these requirements. For example, a minimum of 500 to a maximum of 2000 at a one by one ratio should be short work for Illustrator. Here under the rectangular logo, I get a similar error. My requirements are as follows, 1000 to 500 pixels, a maximum of 2000 to 1000 pixels, two to one ratio, pretty straightforward. But the image that's coming out of Illustrator is 999 by 501 pixels. How can this be? So let's take a look at Illustrator. Here, I'm going to address these two artboards. Under my document setup, I'm definitely dealing with pixels as my units. And when I go to edit these artboards, here is my 1000 by 1000 pixel one by one artboard. And here is my two by one artboard, which is 1000 by 500 pixels. Now I'm going to point out the bug right now. It turns out these X, Y coordinates cannot have these extra decimal places after them. That is what causes the error in these sizes. Let's take a look at what happens when I go to export these items. So I'm simply going to head to export, export for screens, and we'll send these out at 72 DPI as ping files, replacing what's in the folder. And here's what we end up with. My two by one landscape ends up being an odd size, 999 by 501 pixels, and my simple one by one square ends up being 1000 by 1001 pixels. Now, if I don't double check these before I upload them into a system, like Google Merchant Center, for example, it'll just get rejected. For example, let's try to put these into Google Merchant Center. This will get rejected. And here's this one. This one also gets rejected. So after a lot of hair pulling, yelling, and jumping about, and considering alternative careers such as giving a sponge bath to people's pets instead of web development and graphic design, it turns out I've found out the problem has to do with nudging artboards. Notice how when I nudge left and right, the X coordinates change, and when I nudge up and down, the Y coordinates change. If I delete the excess coordinates at the end of these two items, and then I re-export these artboards, I will indeed get the proper size. For example, let's go ahead and dump these out now, exported for screens, and those are the results I'm looking for. My one by one is indeed 1000 by 1000, and my two by one is indeed 1000 by 500. That will be acceptable. I am indeed using the most recent and up-to-date version of Illustrator, which at this point in time is version 26.1. Here's my about screen. Here's my Creative Cloud desktop. So in closing, to clearly document the bug, anytime artboards are nudged on the X or Y axis and result in decimal places, these exports don't maintain their explicitly set size as dictated from the artboard creation tool. This should be fixed. No matter where the artboard has been placed on the actual document, the artboard should always export at the size that has been set here. And that's a wrap. Thanks for watching.